Hey everyone and welcome back to my YouTube channel and welcome back to the Get Famous mansion that I built during the Get Famous trial. And as you can see I've already done the outside or at least like the layout of everything and I also colored the walls of the house and now I'm doing landscaping and just the furnishing of the outside so yeah at the moment I'm putting in the fountains and I wanted different kinds um, in the different areas I had two fountain areas basically one in the back of the build and one in basically the front next to the pool and in the back I went quite elaborate as you saw just in the intro of the video and yeah I put that down I also decorated it a little bit um, the floor of it with some um, of those like, floor decoration and now I'm in the maze and putting down some seating just because um, I think that would be quite nice and as you can see I tried to make it make sense at least a little bit so there are like different kinds of chairs and benches in the different areas. I also put down some more fountains just because I thought that would be fun and why not um, the space allowed it and then I went to the pavilion that I had on the left backhand side and yeah I put down a chess table there and also a table to sit at and potentially eat and as you can see I changed the um, layout so you don't have to go up and down to get to the chess table again and then I put down another eating area outside I also put down the trash cans and the mailbox because I probably would have forgotten if I um, hadn't done that in that moment. I then moved to the pool area and put down some lounge chairs and something to just sit at and then I moved to the um, fountain that I put next to the pavilion and put some seating there as well. There's quite a few options to sit at which I think is probably a little bit excessive but honestly in such a large space you just need to put something there so yeah that was the result of that. I then replicated the fountain and put it down again in the backyard and now I'm just deleting the inside walls that um, I put down when I created the space just so yeah I would be able to do the layout without them interfering and I started with the stairs and then I thought okay now I just need to actually put down some lights because otherwise I won't be able to see anything and then I thought about um, doing the cutouts in the floor but it just wasn't really working I'm not actually sure why you can see here the roof clipping inside and it also deleted the stairs which I'm not sure why it did that and in the end I just decided to do it differently because it just wasn't quite working the way I wanted it to and um, yeah that's why I decided against a cutout it just wasn't working and yeah that is basically the reason and now I'm doing the rooms upstairs I decided on quite large rooms but not as many so it would have been easily possible to do a number of rooms upstairs because the space is so large but because I thought okay in a mansion you wouldn't put like 16 small rooms for uh, um, 16 children because most people don't have that many but also because in a mansion you expect the rooms just to be a little bit larger so there's basically three rooms upstairs um, two teens or children's bedrooms and um, the master bedroom and downstairs as you can see I also already did the layout and I'm just putting down doors at the moment um, 
and yeah downstairs is um, the gym and the garage which are like connected and then next to the gym or pool area um, is like the office and um, library area I also put down um, like the on the opposite side of the office slash library I put down a room and that room is designated for all the like children's toys and then next to that room is the kitchen and, and dining area and um, on the front of the lot is the living room area and yeah those are the different areas that I thought would be appropriate or made sense and um, with the windows I decided on mostly get famous windows wherever possible just because I thought if I have the pack now why not use it um, I did include some base game windows that fit with the style um, especially the larger ones yeah and um, next time I'm going to be furnishing the downstairs areas and um, in the fourth video I'm going to be doing the upstairs and the finishing touches. Now you can see some screenshots of the build. I hope you like it. You can download it from the gallery. My ID is TGG Sims, same as my YouTube channel name. I also hope that you liked the video and will consider pressing the thumbs up button and subscribing. Thanks very much for watching and have a great week. Bye!